guys, Steve Trowbridge here. Um, so for this video, I'm going to be talking about the pipe bomb, or whatever you want to call it, that Paige cut on Raw, this past Raw last night. Um, and I'm sure everybody's heard about it, and I'm sure everybody who watched Raw is probably thinking about it, talking about it, whatever. Um, so yeah, I, like, as I said in my last video, I don't, I don't get the, I don't, buy the WWE pay-per-views. Um, someone in the comments said that the WWE Network is only $9.99. I know that, but the problem is I don't, you know, I'm not a supporter of WWE, so I don't feel like I should spend money on a network that supports WWE, because if I'd be spending that, then I'd be supporting WWE, you know, so, yeah. But, I mean, I might eventually, though. I mean, just to, just to watch NXT and maybe watch, maybe watch some of the pay-per-views, I don't know, but um, maybe, we'll see. But anyways, so yeah, Paige's uh, work shoe promo, pipe bomb, whatever you want to call it. Um, honestly, guys, I'm I'm kind of I'm kind of underwhelmed by it because and maybe that's not the right word to use, but my problem with this is that you know the the, the pipe bombs, work shoe promos, whatever they've been done quite a few times now. I mean, CM Punk did one, you know, the famous the the famous CM Punk. Work shoot promo on Raw back in 2011, the summer of Punk. Um, you know, AJ Lee, she she did she did one on the on the uh, Divas, the Total Divas show. Um, several others. I mean, it's 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 not it's nothing new. That's the problem. It's nothing really new. But basically, in the promo, Paige said, you know, basically, you know, you're just here because of your because of your dad, and you know that's the only reason that you got to where you were. And you're only here because of me, and uh, you know s stuff like that. You know to get to get her to, you know, make her you know turn heel. I mean, basically, I think that's what they were going for is turning her heel. And uh, I did agree when she said there's no revolution because I mean they've been going on about this divas revolution for like a few months now. There's there's no revolution. Okay, the divas revolution is a fucking joke. I mean, if their if their if their idea of a divas res revolution, sorry, I'm stumbling over my words here, but if their idea of a divas res bleh, of a divas re revolution, there we go, came out right that time, is just putting you know these new girls in 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 teams of three and then having tag team matches every week and then just having pointless singles matches every week is the idea of a divas revolution, then yeah, I, you're you're sadly mistaken, Kevin Dunn. Um, yeah, and and I mean, yeah, you're giving you're giving the matches more time. You're giving them a, a little bit more time to wrestle, but so what? It doesn't mean anything in the long run. I mean, unless and this is I think this would be a good idea unless you plan to bring in like a Divas Tag Team Championship because if there was a Divas Tag Team Championship and the teams were fighting over that, that would make more sense. But since they aren't, then there's really no point for these teams to fight other than bragging rights. That's really it. That's all they're really fighting over is for petty bragging rights. And, um, so yeah, the Divas Revolution, complete joke, there is no revolution, never has been. Um, I agreed with Paige on that, but, uh, yeah, the promo, the promo was okay, it was good. Paige isn't the strongest on promos, but, I mean, she, it was, it was okay, it was good. Um, I, you know... If they're gonna turn Paige heel, then I, I I agree with that. I think Paige as a face is not. I don't think she works well as a face. I think she is much better as a heel. I think as a face she is very bland. She's uh, she doesn't work best as a face. Either a heel, or they need to do what NXT did and make her into a tweener, into like a badass tweener, where she's all out for herself. Because and that's what they should do actually, is because I don't want them. Because I don't want them to just turn her heel and then just make her a chicken shit heel, just like they always do, and then have her team with, like, the Bells next week in a match. I don't want them to do that. And from the sounds of the promo, I don't think they're going to do that, but you never know with WWE. They could easily screw this screw this all up. Because I really want them to make her into a tweener who's all out for herself, but um, I, they'll probably find some way to screw it up. They'll probably just turn her into a, to the stereotypical chicken shit heel. And I hope they don't. And if they don't screw this up and they do make this work, then congratulations, WWE. I'll give credit where credit's due. But um, if they do just end up tearing her into a stereotypical chicken shit heel and this, the whole promo, the whole work shoot, pipe bomb, whatever, was pointless. So it was good, but it's just been done before, so it's not really anything new.
So yeah. But yeah, that's that's about it. Um, about it for this video. I just wanted to give my thoughts on this uh, on the page. Um, you know, again for the for a million time, whatever you want to call it, pipe bomb, work shoot, whatever. Just wanted to give my opinions on that. Um, I'm glad Charlotte is the Divas champion. Um, I'm glad that the belt is finally off Nikki Bella. I mean, as you know, I made a video on it before. I'm not a fan of the Bellas. I don't like the Bellas. Um, but yeah, I'm glad. I'm glad Charlotte has that championship, and hopefully, this means that we'll see like Paige versus Charlotte or something like that. If I did Paige versus Charlotte at the next few pay-per-views, I'd, I'd, that'd be cool, I guess. I mean, I'm not, again, I don't buy the pay-per-views, but it'd be cool to see Paige versus Charlotte on Raw or something. I mean, that would be, you know, pretty cool. Should be a good match if they decide to do that. So that'd be pretty cool. But um, yeah, so that's about it, and um, I will talk to you guys later. Peace.